Have you ever felt like an outsider, peering in from the fringes of society, wondering where you fit? This sensation, while often perceived as a burden, is actually a crucible for growth and an incubator for leadership. The strength and insight forged in the solitude of being an outsider has prepared you for leadership in the burgeoning reality of the new earth. In the heart of every person who has ever felt like an outsider lies a profound strength, a hidden well of potential that is often overlooked. This sense of disconnection, of being fundamentally different, can at times be a lonely path. Yet it is this very journey that carves out deep channels of self-awareness, resilience, and an unparalleled compassion for the human condition. These are not mere traits. They are the essential building blocks for leadership in the new earth, a realm where diversity is celebrated and unity is the cornerstone of a higher collective consciousness. Consider the metaphor of a diamond born from the relentless pressure and darkness of the earth. It is the outsider's trials and tribulations that act as this pressure, transforming the carbon of our being into something unbreakable, brilliant, and capable of refracting light in countless directions. This is the process that polishes the soul of the outsider, preparing it for a role far greater than ever imagined. To lead with empathy, insight, and an unwavering commitment to inclusivity. In the new earth, leaders are not those who have walked an easy path, shielded from adversity. Rather, they are the ones who have traversed the valleys of isolation and climbed the mountains of misunderstanding, only to emerge with a deeper understanding of what it means to be truly human. They have learned, through their own experiences of feeling marginalized, how to create spaces where every voice is heard, where every soul is seen, and where every individual is valued. Their leadership is not about imposing visions, but about co-creating realities with all beings, recognizing the interconnectedness of our destinies. Think about a world where the leader is someone who knows what it's like to stand on the outside looking in, who has felt the sting of exclusion, but has used that pain as a catalyst for transformation. This leader understands that true strength lies in vulnerability, in the courage to share one's own story of adversity, and in doing so, empower others to find the hidden gems within their own challenges. Such leaders are adept at navigating the complexities of our global community with its myriad cultures, beliefs and perspectives. They wield the power of their own experiences to bridge divides, heal wounds and draw out the collective brilliance of humanity. Their leadership style is characterized by an intuitive understanding that every individual they encounter is on their own unique journey and that each journey has intrinsic value to the collective growth of our planet. The journey from being an outsider to a leader in the new earth is not linear. It is a spiral of growth, where each loop brings a deeper understanding of oneself and the world. It involves shedding layers of societal conditioning, questioning the status quo, and daring to envision a reality where love, compassion and unity form the foundation of our existence. The New Earth calls for leaders who have been forged in the fires of adversity, who have been sculpted by the trials of being an outsider, and who carry within them the light of hope and the promise of a new dawn. These leaders know that their greatest contribution is their authentic self, their unyielded spirit, and their unwavering belief in the potential of humanity to rise above its limitations and co-create a world of unparalleled beauty and harmony. To you, the one who has felt like an outsider, know that your experiences have not been in vain. They have prepared you for a role of immense importance in our collective evolution. Embrace your journey, for it is your unique path that has equipped you with the vision, the compassion, and the resilience to lead us into the new earth. Your time to shine, to lead, and to inspire is now. In a world where facades often overshadow truth, the essence of authentic leadership shines like a lighthouse guiding the lost ships to shore. 
For those who have tread the lonely path of the outsider, authenticity and integrity do not simply adorn their character. They are the very marrow of their being. These leaders have not arrived at their destination by following the well-trodden paths laid out by others. They have carved their own roots through the dense forests of societal expectations and emerged into the clearing of self-realization. Authenticity in leadership is born from the fires of personal battles and the deep well of introspection that outsiders know all too well. It is the strength gained from these struggles that allows them to stand in their truth, unshaken by the winds of conformity. Leaders forged from such authenticity possess an uncanny ability to connect with others on a profound level. They see beyond the superficial, reaching into the heart of collective experience with empathy and understanding. Their journey of self-discovery becomes a beacon of hope for others, illuminating the possibility of transformation through truth and vulnerability. Consider the power of a leader who shares not just their triumphs but their trials, who speaks not from a pedestal but from the common ground of human experience. This is a leader who does not command respect through authority, but earns it through the resonance of their authenticity. They do not need to convince others to follow. Their genuine nature and steadfast integrity naturally attract those who resonate with their vision and values. This magnetic pull of authentic leadership gathers around it a community of individuals, each unique in their journey, but united in their desire for a world where honesty, transparency, and integrity form the pillars of society. Authentic leaders inspire not by dictating what should be done, but by exemplifying what can be done through the power of living one's truth. They understand that leadership is not about wielding power over others, but about empowering others to find their own strength. In doing so, they create a ripple effect of empowerment where each individual feels seen, heard, and valued for their authentic self. This is the essence of transformative leadership. It fosters an environment where everyone is encouraged to contribute their unique perspective and skills towards a collective vision of the future. The magnetic pull of such leadership does more than just attract, it inspires. It awakens within others the courage to embark on their own journey of self-discovery and self-expression. It challenges the status quo, not through conflict, but through the compelling power of an alternative, a way of being that honors integrity, values diversity, and champions the human spirit. This kind of leadership does not create followers. It nurtures future leaders, each emboldened to carry forth the torch of authenticity and integrity in their own unique way. In a society where authenticity often gives way to expediency and integrity is sometimes sacrificed at the altar of success, the role of the outsider-turned-leader becomes even more critical. They stand as living proof that it is possible to achieve greatness without losing one's soul in the process. They show that leadership is not about climbing the ladder alone, but about ensuring that the ladder is wide enough for everyone to ascend together. Their stories of transformation from the fringes to the forefront remind us that our greatest challenges can become our most powerful assets. Authenticity and integrity, then, are not just virtues to be admired from afar, they are the very foundations upon which a new era of leadership is being built. In this new dawn, the outsider is no longer a figure on the margins, but a central force of change, a leader whose time has come. Their journey, marked by the courage to remain true to themselves amid a world that often demands conformity, offers a blueprint for what leadership can and should be in the age of the new earth. As we stand at the crossroads of history, looking towards the horizon of a future yet unwritten, let us draw inspiration from these authentic leaders. Let their stories remind us that integrity is the compass that guides us, authenticity is the path we walk, and together we can forge a world where every outsider finds their place, not on the fringes, but at the heart of the collective quest for a higher consciousness. 
In the heart of an outsider lies a profound comprehension of the world's intricate web of connections, a truth often unnoticed by those who feel securely anchored within their communities. Outsiders, by virtue of their position on the margins, develop a unique vantage point, allowing them to observe the world not as isolated islands of existence, but as a vast interconnected ecosystem. This understanding, deeply rooted in the psyche of those who have often felt disconnected, paradoxically binds them closer to the very essence of life's interconnectedness. The leadership of the new earth is guided by a similar principle, emphasizing the crucial role of unity and the interconnected nature of our existence. This isn't just a lofty ideal, it's a pragmatic approach to fostering a world where every contribution, no matter how small it might seem, is recognized for its importance in the larger scheme of things. Just as a single thread holds the potential to alter the integrity of a tapestry, every individual's actions and decisions weave into the broader narrative of our planet's future. This sense of unity and oneness transcends mere environmental or social activism. It's a fundamental recognition that diversity is not a hurdle to overcome, but a strength to be celebrated. The richness of our global community lies in its myriad perspectives, cultures and ideas. Outsiders who have navigated the peripheries of social circles understand this better than anyone. They know that the path to a truly inclusive world is not through erasing our differences, but through acknowledging and valuing them within the collective mosaic of humanity. Daily life offers a microcosm of this interconnected reality. Consider the food on your table. It is the culmination of countless hands, from farmers to truck drivers to grocery clerks, each playing a role in a complex chain of events that sustains life or ponder the technology that enables instant communication across the globe, a testament to human ingenuity and cooperation spanning different continents and cultures. These examples are not mere coincidences of modern life. They are manifestations of the deeply woven interdependencies that sustain our world. In recognizing these connections, the New Earth leadership advocates for a world where decisions are made not solely based on individual or immediate benefits, but with consideration for the collective welfare and the planet's health. This vision aligns with the outsider's intuitive grasp of interconnectedness, offering a bridge between personal experiences of isolation and the broader aspiration for a unified global community. The outsider's journey, marked by periods of solitude and reflection, often leads to a profound appreciation for the delicate balance of life. This insight is invaluable in times of crisis or when faced with decisions that impact the collective future. It reminds us that every action, no matter how insignificant it may seem, echoes through the network of life, influencing outcomes far beyond our immediate perception. The interconnectedness celebrated by the New Earth leadership and deeply understood by outsiders is not a mere philosophical concept, but a practical guide for living. It encourages us to consider how our lifestyles, consumption habits and interactions contribute to the fabric of society and the environment. By adopting this mindset, we foster a culture of responsibility and mindfulness, paving the way for a future that honors and nurtures the diversity and interconnectedness of all life. The outsider's intrinsic understanding of being part of something larger, despite feelings of isolation, offers a powerful lens through which we can view our world. It underscores the importance of every individual's contribution to the collective well-being, reinforcing the idea that our diversity, far from dividing us, is actually what makes our global community so resilient and vibrant. The New Earth leadership's focus on interconnectedness is not just a vision for a more inclusive world. It's a call to action for each of us to recognize our role in the vast EF and to act with the awareness that we are all, in fact, inextricably connected. 
Leaders for the new earth are not born from the centers of power, but often emerge from the fringes where the view of the world is painted with the broad strokes of exclusion and marginalization. These experiences, once sources of pain and isolation, transform into powerful tools for empathy and understanding. These leaders use their past as a compass, guiding their vision for a world where inclusivity isn't just an aspiration, but the very foundation upon which societies thrive. They know the sting of being the outsider, and it is this intimate knowledge that propels them to ensure no one else feels that way. The strategies they employ to transition from division to inclusivity are as varied as they are effective. Education plays a pivotal role, not the traditional education that often perpetuates stereotypes and reinforces hierarchies, but an education that is rooted in the stories, histories and cultures of all people. It is through this understanding that the seeds of empathy are sown, allowing individuals to recognize the humanity in those who may walk different paths but share the same earth. Creating environments where differences are celebrated involves dismantling the systems and structures that have historically divided us. This means advocating for policies that not only prevent discrimination, but actively promote diversity in all sectors of society, from governance to workplaces, from educational institutions to the media. Leaders for the New Earth champion the idea that diversity should not be seen as a box to be ticked, but as a strategy for innovation, resilience and excellence. Inclusivity also means creating spaces where people feel seen, heard and valued. This involves more than just physical spaces. It extends to the realms of policy, social media and community engagement. These leaders understand that true inclusivity requires active listening, an openness to change, and the courage to confront uncomfortable truths about privilege and bias. It's about creating forums for dialogue, where all voices, especially those that have been historically marginalized, can contribute to shaping the future. One of the most profound insights from these inclusive practices is the realization that empathy, understanding, and mutual respect are not finite resources, but qualities that grow stronger with use. As communities become more inclusive, they also become more cohesive, fostering a culture where empathy is not just an individual virtue, but a collective practice. This shift doesn't just benefit those who have been marginalized, it enriches everyone by exposing them to a broader range of perspectives, experiences, and ideas. Leaders for the New Earth also recognize the importance of celebrating cultural differences through festivals, art, and public commemorations that honor the contributions of all community members. These celebrations are not just about recognition, they are about weaving the diverse threads of humanity into a vibrant tapestry that tells a more complete story of who we are. It's a testament to the power of inclusivity to not only bridge divides, but also to create a richer, more colorful world. Inclusive practices foster a sense of belonging, which in turn cultivates a culture of empathy and mutual respect. When people feel valued and understood, they are more likely to engage positively with others, contributing to a cycle of inclusivity that self-perpetuates and expands. This culture of inclusivity becomes the bedrock upon which the new earth is built, a world where everyone has a place and differences are not just tolerated but celebrated as the essence of our collective strength. Leaders for the New Earth leverage their outsider experiences to forge a path from division to inclusivity, ensuring that empathy, understanding and mutual respect are not mere ideals, but lived realities. Through education, policy reform, active listening and the celebration of diversity, they create environments where all individuals can thrive. This vision of inclusivity not only challenges us to reimagine our societies, but also invites us to participate in the creation of a world where everyone belongs and differences are the bridges that connect us, not the barriers that divide us. 
the transformed outsider stands at the vanguard of change, embodying the transformative power that emerges from the fringes of society. These individuals, having navigated the complexities of exclusion and marginalization, emerge not embittered but enlightened, carrying with them an understanding that their unique paths are not only valuable but vital in the tapestry of human progress. Their stories serve as beacons, illuminating the path for others who may still be finding their way in the dark showing them that their experiences hold the key to unlocking a collective potential that can reshape the world. Leaders who have embraced their outsider origins possess a rare ability to inspire collective action towards some of the most pressing issues of our time, sustainability, peace, and holistic growth. Their journeys from the periphery to the heart of transformative movements equip them with a deep appreciation for diverse perspectives, allowing them to bridge divides and unite people around shared goals. They understand that true sustainability goes beyond environmental stewardship to encompass social and economic justice, recognizing that a world out of balance cannot sustain itself for long. By leveraging their stories and experiences, these leaders ignite a spark within communities, kindling a desire for change that transcends individual interests. They demonstrate how each person's unique contributions can coalesce into a powerful force for good, driving collective action that prioritizes the well-being of the planet and all its inhabitants. This is leadership not rooted in authority or position, but in authenticity and shared purpose, where the voice of the outsider becomes the rallying cry for a new vision of what is possible. These leaders also show us that peace is not merely the absence of conflict, but the presence of justice, understanding and mutual respect. They champion holistic growth, advocating for a model of development that nurtures the spirit as well as the body and the mind, recognizing that true progress cannot be measured solely by material gain. In this vision, every individual has a role to play, and every story, especially those forged in the crucible of adversity, is a source of strength and wisdom. The call to action for readers is clear. Reflect on your outsider experiences, not as liabilities, but as the bedrock upon which your potential leadership roles in the new earth can be built. These experiences have equipped you with resilience, empathy, and a unique perspective that the world desperately needs. It's time to see your journey not as a path walked alone, but as part of a larger movement towards a more inclusive, sustainable and compassionate world. This is not just an invitation, but a challenge to rise, to leverage your unique insights and experiences in service of a greater good. The new earth needs leaders who can see beyond the status quo, who can imagine a future defined not by division, but by unity, not by scarcity, but by abundance. Your outsider experience with all its trials and triumphs has prepared you for this moment. Embrace it. Use it to inspire others, to mobilize action, and to lead with a vision that celebrates diversity as the wellspring of our collective strength and creativity. In the end, the transformed outsider stands as a testament to the power of individual transformation to catalyze global change. Their leadership embodies the highest ideals of the new earth, where every individual is valued, every voice is heard, and every action contributes to a larger purpose. Let their journey inspire you to see your own in a new light, as a catalyst for change and a beacon of hope for a world awakening to its full potential. As you stand amidst the shifting tides of change, remember, you are not just a bystander in the narrative of our evolution. Through adversity, you've honed resilience. Through challenges, you've cultivated wisdom. Now, embrace your scars as badges of honor, for they are the mark of your transformation. The new earth beckons, craving the mosaic of voices and perspectives only you can bring. Share your stories, ignite the flame of change, and subscribe to our channel.
Together, let us sculpt a tomorrow where every soul finds its rightful place in the symphony of existence.